the Personal Touches Handicap is next. It's over one mile and three furlongs, and it's a 0 to 90, and it's got a massive field. Uh, at the top, we've got Airfleet Paul Rhodes, Ramaswell Guard, Derek Hinton, Anna of Troy, Paul Rhodes, Small Vacation, Craig Beckwith, Matter of Contention, Leon Van Rensburg, Agador, Spartacus, John Morgan, Land of Promise, Joshua Sutherland, Zulu Dawn, Stu Gray, Spring Into Action, Craig Beckwith, Palmetto, Obi Wan, Drawback Arrow, CDJ Liggett, Waldorf, Salad, Martin Lidham, Lakota Enzyme, Padraig Hogan, Non Fiction, Kevin Meanhan, Ompery, Martin Lidham, Gilderoy Ward, Padraig Hogan, Multi Blessing, Satyam Sandra Sagram, Gunslinger Contract, Thomas Rogers, Jew Drop, and East Kilbride. Pirate Matt Cooper and Kin Craig Alliance for Alex Cherry. That's your 21 then in this race, and they're away and racing and straight off on a turn. And you can see that quite a lot of these are going to be right out of it from the start. Now, I'm going to use this to have a rant now, and I don't like having rants too often, but there are too many horses this season rated under 90, there are too many horses rated under 70. And these handicaps, these are supposed to have 8, 9, 10 runners in to give the middling to lower trainers chances of wins. And we've got most of the top trainers are in this. And there's too many runners in it. Too many horses rated under, under 90. If you're a trainer and you can get your horse into a, a, a 0 to 90 and you're trying to win the title, you're going to put one in and nobody can blame you for that. There's got to be something done about the ratings of some of these are they're too low this season. I don't mean to have a pop at a handicapper, but maybe everything needs to go up ten pounds, I don't know. But anyway, Hagador Spartacus is in the lead. Land of Promises on the inside. Then comes Anna of Troy, non fiction and Dewdrop after that one. With matter of contention and then Rama Twelve Guard, but it's Dewdrop who's now burst out into the lead. From multi blessing in the second. And those two are clear of matter of contention. And Gunslinger Contact, then Agador Spartacus, Anna of Troy, Ramatwell Guard, Kring, Craig Alliance is close up as well. Spring into action is the back marker, but it's Dewdrop in front from Multi Blessing in second. Agador Spartacus is in third, then Ompreys after that one, and Anna of Troy and Ramatwell Guard is next, then Lakota Enzyme is after that one as they race down towards the final three furlongs. Dewdrop continues to lead from Ompere who's now second then Land of Promise is third Palmetto is fourth Anne of Troy is after that Multi Blessing is next the one that's bursting up the centre of the track Ramatwell Guard coming to challenge the leader who's now Ompere so past the two furlong pole Ompere's gone into the lead but he's immediately being pressed on his inside by Agador Spartacus on his outside by Matter of Contention and Gunslinger Contract Ramatwell Guard coming through as well they're coming inside the final furlong and it's now Agador Spartacus who's hit the front from Ompere in second Agador Spartacus Spartacus from Ompere as they race up towards the line. It's going to be Agador Spartacus who's going to take this. John Morgan stealing a 0 to 90, but who can blame him? Ompere second, Gunslinger Contact third, Lakota Enzyme is next, and then Small Vacation. And it's a win for John Morgan, who took about three Group 1s on day one, and he's taking a 0 to 90 here. And. Off just 80 as well. So Agador Spartacus for John Morgan, the winner. Ompere second for Martin Lidham. Gunslinger contact for Thomas Rogers third. Lakota Enzyme for Padraig Hogan was fourth. And Zulu Dawn for Stu Gray was fifth.